Uh, it was obviously good to get a win um, last time out against North Dakota. Um, it was a grind. Uh, we knew it was going to be a grind. Uh, but I was extremely proud of, of the perseverance that we showed, the resilience that we showed. I think any time you see a teammate go down uh, in a game, it, it's hard to get yourself together. Um, and I thought our kids did a, a nice job of that and, and finding a way to come away uh, with a win. Um, obviously, we, we know Megan, we know the severity of the injury. Um, she's out for the year, but we're extremely confident that she will get uh, a red shirt. Uh, so we'll still have two years to play. So we're extremely thankful for that. Um, and uh, she will have surgery a week from today. Uh, but if there's a blessing, uh, it, it comes in a couple of ways. A, she gets the red shirt year back. Uh, and, and B, uh, it came in a time where we're, we have a stretch where 10, 12 days off where we could try to get some things figured out. Uh, so right now, obviously, we're in the midst of finals. Um, we practiced. Uh, we played last Tuesday. We was off Wednesday, Thursday, practiced Friday, Saturday, took Sunday, and today off, and then we'll get back after it tomorrow. As I told our team, uh, obviously, you, you never want to see anyone go down, especially someone uh, on your own team. Um, but it's a part of it. Adversity is, is something that we go through, and it comes in many forms, and this is just one of those things. We will figure out how to pick ourselves up, dust ourselves off, and, and get back to work. I don't expect any one player to fill Megan's shoes, nor do we need any one player to fill Megan's shoes. What we need is uh, everybody has to be a little bit better in what they do, uh, starting with me. Uh, so we, we will that's how we'll approach it. Our goals remain the same, and that's to come to work every day and try to get better and try to be playing our best basketball in March. But um, Megan's in good spirits, and our team's in good spirits. Are there any questions? How do you feel about that core kind of behind Megan, Taylor, Heidi, Bruce, Cynthia, the kind of things that they can do on the floor? They're in the position well, to help out. And that's a good question. Taylor has been playing really pretty good basketball. Um, and we need her to continue to do that. I really like the last couple games Heidi has played, her urgency, her ability to knock down a couple shots and, and rebound. She's been all over the place. You're starting to see the progression in Bree. She rebounds the basketball extremely well. We need her to continue to be a little bit more um, assertive offensively. Um, and, and continue to uh, rebound the basketball for us. And, and CJ, CJ has to grow up. I mean, she's going to have to put on her, her, her big girl uh, pants. And, and I think she's ready for that and, and is ready to embrace that. They're com all completely different, completely different from Megan. So all of them give us different looks. What's the scouting report was for now on Iowa? <laughs> well, we know they have an All-American in the middle, uh, extremely efficient. All-American, uh, boy, she's she's as good as I've seen, and I've seen a lot of really good players. But in terms of her efficiency um, around the, the bucket, and she's really, really good. She's averaging a double-double. Iowa has five kids in double figures. Uh, they're well coached. They can score inside and out. They spread you out. Uh, they do a lot of different things. Um, we're going to have to really um, – you, you're not going to stop Megan. Uh, you just got to hope to slow her down and, and really try to make their shooters put the basketball on the floor and, and really kind of keep them guessing defensively. Uh, but you got, when you get them to miss, you got you to make sure you box out uh, because they offensive rebound extremely well. And then we got to take care of the basketball on offense, and, and we can't be afraid to, to step up and, and hit some shots because you're, you're going to get shots and you got to be able to knock them down.